You know, there's a lot of good people in this business. I mean, if you really think about it, most people have to have some harder desire. They like kids, all right? So we, we, we have good people, but how come we still have so many bad outcomes? And so the Burns Institute was influential in helping us to take on our very first major uh, racial ethnic disparity situation, and that was the school to prison pipeline. We took the data and we noticed that uh, we had over a 2,000 percent increase in referrals from schools uh, since uh, the uh, year one when we first put police on campus. We, we found that 92 percent of those referrals um, were misdemeanor low-level offenses, disorderly conduct and uh, school fights and uh, disrupting public school. Well, you know, then we broke it down further and we found, my gracious, okay, uh, that an overwhelming number of those were, um, you know, African-American youth. So we knew there was an issue, okay. So, you know, we set up our system. Consequently, we have been able to reduce the number of youth of color referred uh, to court uh, by, uh, see, 53 percent. The Burns Institute, you know, I mean, they, they are so data-driven because we want to get to the truth. We, we need to really take a look at the numbers. This is not about saying that anyone's a racist, but we know from our business at the Burns Institute that it's really about the systems we work in. And the data helps us to take another look at the system.